You may have heard that a laboratory grown diamond has been made out of ranch seasoning. That's right, Hidden Valley have used their ranch seasoning to create a two carat laboratory grown diamond. You may have a few questions such as, is this even possible? So let's talk about it. Hi, I'm Julia the Gemologist from the Gem Academy and welcome to my YouTube channel, the place for gem and jewelry professionals who would like to learn more about laboratory grown diamonds. <laughs> Hidden Valley Ranch had a lab grown diamond made out of its beloved seasoning for National Ranch Day. There's a ranch day? And it's being auctioned off with all proceeds benefiting Feeding America. So Hidden Valley have announced that the idea for this came about when somebody proposed with one of their special edition Valentine's sauce bottles last year. And they wanted to take this connection between love and ranch even further. <laughs> so can a laboratory grown diamond be made from this seasoning? And how could one go about creating such a thing? Well, diamonds are made from carbon, pure carbon. So technically, one could make a laboratory grown diamond out of pretty much anything that contains carbon. So let's check out the ingredients of Hidden Valley Ranch seasoning and see what it contains. If it contains carbon, it's game on. Hidden Valley Ranch seasoning ingredients. Okay, salt, onion, modified food starch, sugar, garlic, spices, maltodextrin, buttermilk, dextrose, and some other stuff. Some of the other ingredients listed here, so the onion and the garlic, these are derived from plants. And plants are carbon-based life forms. So this is where the carbon will be. It will be mainly in the form of carbohydrates. So glucose, fructose, and other sugars these consist of carbon, hydrogen, and oxygen. And it's this carbon that can be used to create a laboratory grown diamond. However, the carbon in carbohydrates is far from pure. So if we want to make a laboratory grown diamond, the first stage is to extract this carbon in a process known as purification. Purification is a unique process where they convert the ranch seasoning or whatever it is that contains carbon into a pure carbon source that would be suitable for diamond synthesis and they do this using a really high heat reduction process. This strips the atoms into single carbon atoms, and then these come together to form graphite. Graphite is pure carbon and is one of the most common starting materials for creating laboratory grown diamond usually. So from here, the process is exactly the same as creating laboratory grown diamond, specifically using HPHT synthesis. So HPHT synthesis is one of the two most commonly used methods for creating laboratory grown diamonds. This process uses high temperatures and high pressures to dissolve the graphite and the carbon, which is now free from its graphite bonds, recrystallizes as laboratory grown diamonds due to this high temperature and pressure environment. And that's it, simples. Using this process, we can technically make laboratory grown diamonds out of lots of things as long as they contain carbon. So this is the process that's used for creating laboratory grown diamonds out of human ashes. There are some doubters whether this is possible, turning human ashes into laboratory grown diamonds, but it is possible, it's very possible using the method that I just described. Oh, no way. So this ranch laboratory grown diamond was created from the geologist and founder of Life Gem. So this is a company that makes laboratory grown diamonds from the human ashes. Well, there we go, it all makes sense. The Hidden Valley Ranch laboratory grown diamond is up for auction on eBay. It was originally put up for a modest $310. 
And if we have a look right now, its current highest bid is $12,450. A two carat round brilliant laboratory grown diamond that's not made from ranch seasoning is currently priced from around $7,000. Hidden Valley are doing pretty well with their bids so far, which is great as all the proceeds are going to charity. There's a couple of days left on this auction, so let's keep it rolling. <laughs> That's it from me today. If you work with diamonds, subscribe to this YouTube channel as I'll be here for you on Tuesdays. I hope you enjoyed this video by The Gem Academy. Feel free to comment below and I'll see you next week for more. Subscribe and I'll see you soon. At two carrots, it's really going to sparkle on the hand when the wearer dips their pizza in ranch. Now if that doesn't scream romance and luxury, I don't know what does.